All right, so we're going to look at our SOMSO renal anatomy model. So here is a cross section of the kidney as a whole. The nephron, the renal corpuscle. All right, so a cross section of the whole kidney. The outside of the kidney is the renal capsule. Here, this area here, there to there, the renal cortex. From the top of this end will be the renal medulla. So cortex, medulla, those are the layers. And the medulla, each one of these is a pyramid and each one of these is a column. Pyramid, column, pyramid, column. You get the idea. Capsule, cortex, medulla, pyramid, column. Column, pyramid. The tip of each pyramid is called the renal papilla. This little structure here with a five on it is a minor calyx. Multiple minor calyces drain together into a major calyx. And then the major calyces drain together into this structure, the renal pelvis. So, renal pelvis, this would lead out to the ureter. Renal pelvis, major calyx, minor calyx. Tip of each pyramid is the renal papilla. You can also see blood vessels here. So we have, here we have our, our renal artery which branches into segmental arteries, which branches into an interlobar artery, which makes these little arcs here. These are cortical radiate, sorry, excuse me. These are the arcuate arteries with the arc. The little bitty ones that come off the top are cortical radiate arteries. They look like spokes. So little spoky ones, cortical radiate, arcuate, interlobar, segmental renal artery. Renal artery, segmental artery, anterolobar artery, arcuate artery, cortical radiate artery. So here we're looking at this arc, again, is the cortical radiate artery. Each one of these is an cortical radiate. So each one of these little things those little spheres are renal corpuscles. The first part of this tubule system that comes off here with a two on it, there, is the proximal convoluted tubule. This part with a three on it, is the nephron loop or the loop of henry henley the loop of henley this with a five on it is the distal convoluted tubule with a six is the collecting duct so corpuscle proximal convoluted tubule loop of henley distal convoluted tubule collecting duct so there's a nephron this bank of blood vessels right here see the red and blue that's called the vasa recta now let's take a close-up of that corpuscle so the outer shell of this is called bowman's capsule this ball of capillaries is the glomerulus this is our afferent arteriole. This is our efferent arteriole. So afferent's got a six on it. Efferent's got a seven on it there. In between the glomerulus, each one of these little cells is called a podocyte. And you can see the little blue nuclei there. So that's a podocyte. This cross section right here the afferent arteriole, those are granular cells.
So, glomerulus, Bowman's capsule, afferent arteriole, efferent arteriole, podocytes, granular cells.